Well, thankfully here in South Florida, expecting mostly dry but warm conditions as we head into the final weekend of 2018. Here's a live view from our CBS 4 camera in Doral. As the sun is setting, we still have a few lingering clouds. The high today in Miami, 82 degrees. We woke up to 75. And keep in mind, our average high this time of year is 77. So our lows were already close to the highs in the morning hours. And we should be enjoying low 60s for our lows. The record high is 84. In Fort Lauderdale, 81 the high. 83 in Key West, and you had a low of 77. Current temperatures right now, well, still in the low 80s for Key West and Marathon. 79 in Miami, Fort Lauderdale, Kendall, and Homestead. And the wind is beginning to relax, especially in comparison to the past few evenings right now out of the southeast, a 12 miles an hour. However, throughout the day, we have had some pretty high peak wind gusts. In fact, as high as 30 to 36 miles an hour in spots, especially in Broward County. That's where it's been quite blustery. And now we're seeing a few showers pushing into Broward County near Fort Lauderdale Airport, Fort Lauderdale, Wilton Manors, Pompano Beach, as well as near 595 in Hollywood. But thankfully, we're not dealing with this active weather across the Panhandle and up the Atlantic seaboard all the way up through the northeast New England areas. This frontal boundary is leading to not only rain, but snow and wintry precipitation on the northern side. And as we take a look at the temperatures behind this front, it is frigid for much of the nation. Look at the team in Minneapolis, the 20s and 30s in Chicago, Kansas City, Denver, Albuquerque, and Billings, Salt Lake City. And then we have 40s in Memphis, Dallas, and then 60s ahead of the front in Atlanta, New Orleans. So again, in the sweet spot for us tonight, low 70s with a chance for stray showers. That breeze out of the southeast, 10 to 15 miles an hour. Could see some patchy fog inland overnight into the morning. Thankfully, we're not seeing any advisories uh, for boaters. Wind southeast, 10 to 15 knot seas, 2 to 5, moderate chop on the bays. However, a dangerous high risk of rip currents continues through late tonight, so swimming is still not recommended. Tomorrow for your Saturday, 83 the high, so it still will be very warm with that lighter breeze and a few showers, as you can see. So not as windy as we get into your Saturday, as that front is not going to affect us. It's going to lift to the north. So New Year's Eve evening on Monday, 77 around 7 p.m., mainly dry around 9 p.m., 74, and around midnight when the fireworks go off, mostly clear, and we'll start the new year on Tuesday with low 70s in the morning, highs in the low 80s, and continuing that through the middle of next week.